Hi, I am Mathieu and I work on the application security threats team at Datadog. We're the team that works on all protection features, the application security product, such as IP blocking and the in-app WAF. I want to show you how you can use Datadog application security to detect and protect yourself from common attack tools using our in-app WAF. Let's say I'm a product owner responsible for the product recommendation service, and I notice a spike in errors. I check to see if the reason for this spike is stemming from an attacker, in which case I can get the security team involved. It looks like the most recent security signal detected is one where someone tried to use attack tools against the service. So it looks like an attacker is actively attempting to get into the application. Right from the signals, I can see that the recommended action is to update my in-app WAF policy. Through this model, the recommended change is to apply the block attack tools policy to my service. This ensures that moving forward, Datadog will block and monitor all attack tools before they can negatively impact my service. Something really cool here is that my security team can easily review and update the in-app WAF configuration. Datadog provides three policies for you. The first one is the monitoring only policy, which applies no blocking. This is the default policy in application security. Then comes the attack tool blocking policy, which only blocks attack tools and monitors other attacks. Finally, block attack tools and application attacks policy blocks attack tools and other attacks Datadog recommends blocking. The attack tool blocking policy can easily be applied at scale, meaning that all services with Datadog application security can automatically get protected from attack tools. To summarize, in this video, I showed how quick and easy it was to block attacks so that I have more time to remediate a vulnerability. If you have any feedback on how this workflow works for you, please share in the comments below. Thank you.